Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet a bath puff. So let's get started. I'm working with 100% worsted yarn and a 6 millimeter crochet hook. Start with a slip knot. Chain 100. Like that, chain 100. Okay, I have worked my foundation chain of 100. So now I'm going to double crochet, yarn around the hook, in the fourth stitch from the hook. So one, two, three, four. Double crochet, chain one. Skip the next stitch, double crochet in the next. Chain one. Skip, double crochet. Like that, repeat all the way down the chain. Okay, I've gone ahead and I have double crocheted in every second stitch all the way across my foundation chain. And that's what it will look like. And now I'm going to chain two, one, two, and turn. And in every one of these chain one spaces, I'm going to make three double crochet. Yarn around the hook, insert into the space, pick up the yarn and pull it through, pick up the yarn, pull it through two, pick up the yarn, pull it through two. So you're going to make three in every space. So that's two and three. Go to the next chain one space, make three double crochet. One, two, and three. Okay, like that. Three in every space. One, two, three. So, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. All the way across the row. Okay, I finished that row. And I have three double crochet in each chain one space. Chain two and turn. Make two more double crochet in this same stitch at the beginning of the row. So, one and two. Now in every double crochet you're going to make three double crochet so one two three one two three one two three all the way across the row. So one two and three. See all in the same stitch. One, two, and three. All the way across the row. Okay, I've gone ahead and worked all the way across the row. And there's what that will look like. So there's my row of double crochet and then three double crochet in every chain one space. And then three double crochet in every stitch all the way across the row. So you have this flouncy looking long strip like that and now I'm going to make a chain of 60. So chain 60. Okay I have chained 60 and now I'm going to take my chain and I'm going to weave through this row of double crochet. So go in and out in and out, in and out, all the way across the row. Okay, I passed all the way through, and now I'm going to pull these two, and I'm going to bring this all together in a gathered ball. And then I'm going to take one end and tie a knot. like that. Now take this other end and I'm going to bring this here and tie another knot and that'll be the hanging cord. Tie a square knot and then just do a few more for safety's sake. And there you go, you have a bath puff. Now you can use this in the bath or you could even use it to wash dishes. 
Please subscribe, please comment, and please click like.